Oh, it's recording. Is it recording now? Yikes. <laughs> no. How do you answer? When will you marry? When will I marry? When will you marry? When will you marry? Inshallah. Inshallah. Soon. No. No, no, no. I've been going for 16 minutes. Um. What should you know about? Okay, start on the first one. This is with your... Okay. Flip-flops. No. Ship-ship. Me and Mama, and I made her make fun of her in the car. We said she was some ship-ship. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. These are my sisters. Um, this is Amanda. Hi, and I'm this is Lauren. Lauren. Today we are doing a sister Q&A. We asked you guys to send us some questions on my Instagram. You guys sent some really good questions and so we're gonna read those and try to answer them. Yay! We're so excited. <laughs> I had a lot of questions about like how old are you and like what your ethnicity is so we can like start with that. Okay. Okay, go. okay, I'm okay. 17 years old, and just like Lena, we're all half American, half Arab. People think that we're like half sisters or like I know people think adopted. That <laughs> oh yeah, no, yeah. People think that we're like not real sisters or like we don't have the same parents or something. But yeah, like we just look different. I feel like we all have a lot of the same features. I know, though. like me, me and Lauren and kind of have, have the like nose. the same kind of features, and especially like Amanda and like our little Nine. brother. Naeem, we all like we look favor. A lot I guess it's like the hair color throws, it throws people, people off, off. and like the skin off. color because you're like more white when you're not fake tanned. <laughs> oh, not that so. in there. My name's Amanda, and I'm 20 years old. And they also wanted to know like what um, we all study and stuff, and like oh. what we want to be one day. <laughs> Lauren, <laughs> take it away. Well, I'm a senior in high school. So I'm not in college yet, and I don't know what I want to do, so we'll figure that so out. So she has a lot of time. Come on. You had something you were interested well, in. Well, yeah. Oh, like, you mean, like, interior? Yeah! Yeah, I like house stuff. I am a junior in college at Texas A&M and College Station. Um, my degree is University Studies Leadership, and I have two minors. One of them is Agricultural Journalism and Communications, and the other one is Event Management. So basically, oh, like, she could cool. do any kind of, like, leadership yeah. Um, position like when she graduates. <clears throat> right now I'm doing an internship with um, a company that does a lot of events and right now we're working on a few that are in College Station so I help with events so and help, do like, event coordinating yeah, the marketing stuff. for that. Okay, this is a good one. Okay, what, what is your pet peeve about each other? Oh my god. Oh god. We've got a lot of them. I don't okay, have one pet peeve about Lena. What? Why do you have to start with me? <laughs> because Amanda doesn't have that many. <laughs> Okay, whenever, like, we cook eggs in the pan. Come on now. She leaves it. Like, I do crusty, not. Like, so crusty. <laughs> so crusty I around. do not. And she, like, doesn't clean it until, like, three hours later. I like to eat my eggs hot. And so whenever I cook my eggs, like, I go and eat it and then I clean. And Amanda, yeah. pet peeve about you. She did, I, I really can't think of Yeah, so Amanda doesn't, like, well. have anything that she Thank does. Thank you. That's, like, Thank you. Amanda's perfect. Okay, my pet peeve about Lauren is she's just freaking bipolar. <laughs> One moment she's like, I'm gonna kill somebody, let me stab you with my knife. And <laughs> then the next the moment, then the next, next moment, she's like, oh, let's like film a video, let's do <laughs> <start it back." laughs> If you'll ever argue, what is it most likely about? Let me answer that. Okay. First. It's usually I'm like the. She's the referee. I'm the referee. Yeah. And Between me and Lauren. Lauren and Lena are fighting. Like, Oh my god. The main thing that we fight about is borrowing like, each other's stuff. Okay, listen. Okay, no, you listen to me. <laughs> no, I have my own stuff. I have my makeup, I have my closet, I have my things. Lauren here thinks that they're hers too, okay? They are mine. <laughs> no, they are not. I have my RCMA no color powder. She comes into my bathroom, steals the powder. Every day, I have to go into her bathroom to use my powder. What's one embarrassing thing that happens to each of you? One embarrassing okay. thing about Lena is whenever she sleeps, I guess she sleeps in like a really deep sleep. Whenever oh, anyone yeah. tries to wake her up, she literally like doesn't know where she is. I'm, okay, but so one night, my room is right across the hall from hers, and I was like about to go to sleep. Lena has already been asleep for like an hour or so, and I hear this like knocking on the window or like knocking from somewhere. I'm like, where is that coming from? And it was Omar at her window. I knew it was Omar, so I came in here and I was gonna wake Lena up, but I knew when I tried to wake her up, she was gonna freak out. I was like, Lena. Lena. You're very gently. And Lena's like, oh, what? Mama? 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 I'm like, what is something you like to do together? 
like go to New York and like, go shopping and then find different like yeah, coffee shops like, and like, different yeah. juice places. We can't go to New York every weekend or anything like that. Yeah, we we go love going to Dallas, Dallas and doing the same thing. Like, trying new restaurants, yeah. going just walking around shopping. Taking pictures. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's like our favorite things yeah. to do. What is your favorite makeup product? What is your favorite makeup product of mine, Lauren? My favorite makeup product? Okay, if you don't have this lipstick in your life, you need it. Bobbi Brown Fair Pink. Done. Yeah, I'm wearing that right that now. That is a really pretty color. If you have fair skin, it's a good nude pink for your mm -hmm. skin tone. Well, I cannot live without my Maybelline Fit Me concealer. I wear that like almost every day. Like even if I'm not wearing like foundation or anything, I wear that. Amanda <laughs> doesn't need to wear makeup. Oh my gosh. She doesn't, doesn't. Like, She's not even wearing foundation. She doesn't I wear, wear powder. Mascara and powder. Which mascara do you use? L'Oreal telescopic. The telescopic. The gold one or the mm -hmm. black one? Gold. gold. Mm -hmm. How to improve your self-esteem. How to improve your self-esteem. Okay, yeah. one thing about us is we compliment each other a lot. Like, we boost each other's self-esteem yeah, for sure. Yeah, that is like, so true. Like, oh, I'm girl, you look good. I'm vibing this. Yeah. We got that from our mom. For sure, Because yeah. mama, she, like, always compliments everything about mm -hmm. us. What do you love about each other the most? Man is very caring. Amanda like, is like a mother. Is. She takes care of everybody. <laughs> like, before herself. Before herself, yeah. My favorite thing about Lena, she's like... Like, always down to, like, do anything. We'll just, like, oh, yeah. you want to go do this? Like, oh, yeah. And she's genuinely just, like, a nice person. Yeah. Aww. Lena is very like nice. The nice way you are on your Instagram and blog, like it's how not an act. Like, that's really how you are. Yeah. Like, Aww. that's really you. You genuinely, genuinely like that. Oh, they're so sweet. Hey, Lauren, <laughs> there's nothing. <laughs> Despite... The mood swings. Despite the mood swings, Lauren is very sweet. She really she is. is. And she really does care. Yeah. What are your favorite seasons? Fall and winter. But we live in Texas, so we don't get much of it. Yeah, so agreed. Mm -hmm. Okay. Summer's too hot here. What mm -hmm. is your funniest and silliest childhood memory? Mm -hmm. We gotta think. I know one. When we, when we used to live in our old house, <clears throat> we used to play... Uh, kitchen or house yeah we used to play house yeah especially lena and oh my we god had, like, we got this, so into it we had like this like tree or bush outside with these like beans and lena <laughs> would go outside and like pick the beans and put them in our <laughs> pot so much fun. and then go inside and like cook with it what now okay question next question uh, tell us about your fitness routine i love you so much uh okay okay these two are low-key swole <laughs> Lena's is kind of different than ours, so she can. Go yeah. Okay, because theirs is better than mine. So, so mine basically, I used to do like a lot more cardio. Now I've gotten more into like weight training, and so I do that like about uh, three or four times a week. I try to um, do more than that, but um, that's pretty much what I've been getting in the last few weeks. My diet, I'm not like super hardcore on my macros or anything. I just try to like eat when I'm hungry and don't eat when I'm not, and um, try to eat like whole foods. Yeah, we all eat very clean, mm -hmm. and a lot of people don't understand that mm -hmm. or don't... Or don't realize the importance of it. But, I mean, once we've been eating like that for so long, yeah. I would never go back. We train six days a week, pretty heavy. Right now, we're really trying to, like, put on, some, put on some size. <laughs> put on some size, like, I don't know. Like, most girls, I feel like they when they talk about working out, it's just like, oh, I want to be skinny, but... Me and Amanda, like, really want to, like... They want to be swole. What is one object that you love and wouldn't want to live without? I'm actually, like, not attached to anything. Like, I could live without oh, anything. Your pajamas, oh, your pajamas. Okay. Your cheetah pajamas. Oh. Pajamas. Your robe. Literally. No. Oh. Robe. oh, my robe. Oh, Lord, the robe. I'm not really attached to any certain, like, object either. Besides your phone. But she never answers my phone. She never answers. I never call my phone. If you call Lena, she's not going to answer Just don't you. call. Just don't even call her. Where is your happiest place? The gym, yeah. <laughs> okay, the gym, we got it. Okay. Um, but don't worry. Anyway, <laughs> with Max. It's Max. With Max, our it's kitty cat. cat. Um, each one of you tell us about a major obstacle you overcame and learned from. Okay, I feel like I'm like I'm only seventeen. Like, she hasn't I lived long enough to go overcome any obstacles. Okay, so, hands down, my biggest obstacle was like whenever I put on my hijab. And I knew that that is what felt right for me, and I knew that's what I wanted to do, but I just was so self-conscious going out and meeting people for the first time and, like, having to explain myself. But what I learned from that is just that, you know, you're the same person on the inside, and people um, will accept you for who you are. You know, I, I was so scared to see um, people that I knew, and I was so scared that they were going to be, like, 
judging me or you know treating me differently but then I realized that they just treated me the same because I was just the same person yeah. I just literally just had like a scarf on my head it, was, it wasn't that much of a difference yeah. so. uh, one big obstacle for me was for sure moving out and kind of doing things on my own it's a huge adjustment yeah it was really big <laughs> yeah Oh, okay. How do they support you wearing the hijab? Okay. 100. Posted. 100. Uh, this is still my sister. And one thing that we get asked a lot is, like, are we all Muslim? And yes, we're all Muslim. Yes, Obviously, yeah. you don't have to wear a hijab to be Muslim. And wearing a hijab doesn't mean that you're, like, more religious or you're a better Muslim than someone else. It's just, like, a choice that you made. And it's really, that's just such a misconception sometimes we do not treat obviously don't treat lena any differently yeah, than me. oh my god no you know would like practice like wearing the hijab going out to eat like there was nothing like oh my gosh i don't want lena to come yeah, with us she's no. wear her scarf yeah. no not or i'd be like all. does this look okay does like does this like, style look okay and they'd be like yeah that looks great like they would mm -hmm. be like yeah. really supportive who's your favorite singer Lena doesn't, Lena doesn't even know i don't music listen to is. music we like rap music chance the rapper Okay. Okay, if you could pick one quality from one another for yourselves, uh, what would you pick? I would take Lauren's... She doesn't care what people think about yeah. her. Yeah. I wish I had that, because yeah. I feel like I have too much... I care too much about things I shouldn't care about, so I definitely Yeah, Lauren that. doesn't care what yeah, people don't. think. She don't, don't give a... She didn't even take Lena's <laughs> blog. I would take her life. I remember when Lena started her blog, we were like, They thought that it was so the dumb. most dumbest yeah. thing ever. I used to take pictures in front of my front door, and I would make them take pictures of me. And <laughs> yeah. we're so rude. No, we don't want to take your picture. They never want to come to something you'll have in common with, something you'll disagree on. Okay, I feel like oh. you guys are, like, my best friends. Like, I don't have any other, like, girlfriends that I just connect with we have a lot of things in common we, we all like, love almond milk lattes Hashtag oh yeah we do. almond milk lattes are love <laughs> uh, what's something y'all disagree on um mm. lena likes tomatoes not only yeah tomatoes. i freaking hate tomatoes <laughs> all have like different styles yeah. but it's not something that we disagree we like appreciate each other's styles yeah but, like me but and i kind of like that we don't have the style thing. but I kind of grew out. She kind of like I elevated her class. Her. Yeah. Lena's not classy. <laughs> Favorite memory together. Like when we went to Mexico like two summers ago and we went to, oh, oh. and like one of the days like we would like went to the spa and it was oh, so Oh, that was fun. so fun. Oh my gosh. Oh, and then like waking up early and going to the gym and yeah, then getting like breakfast. getting breakfast. Like, that's just, like, the kind of stuff we like to I do. Know. Yeah. I know. I love that stuff. Oh. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for sending all of your questions. We really enjoyed answering those for you, and I hope that you guys enjoyed getting to know us a little bit better. And I will link my sister's Instagram down below so that you guys can uh, keep up with them. And thank you guys so much for doing Thanks. this with me. It was so much fun.